you know, too often we're distracted by our own needs and by all the things that, that take our time away from us, the noise of our daily lives. But we need to teach ourselves to fight through this noise and consider the needs of others. Remember, remember, we're all leaders, and leadership is influence. You never know who's watching. Let me finish with a, a short story about a pastor friend of mine. He tells the story of getting up on a Saturday morning to go to Lowe's to buy some supplies to take to his mother's house so that he can make some minor repairs. And he's in a hurry, and you've been to Lowe's on a Saturday morning. Sometimes it's a little crowded, and he's got to get there, get done. She lives about five hours away, so he is on the, he's trying to get on the road, get there. He has to be back to his church on Sunday morning. A lot to do. Time is not on his side. So he gets the supplies. He gets in line. He waits through three or four people. He gets up to the cashier, pays for his order, goes to his car, puts his things away. As he's putting his change in his pocket, he realizes that she's given him more money than he deserves for his change. Now remember, he's in a hurry. And he pauses for a moment and he says, uh, I've got to go. But, thank goodness, the right thing happens. He goes back inside. He gets back in line, same cashier, waits for a couple people, walks up and says, ma'am, I'm sorry, you gave me $20 more than, than, uh, than I deserve for my uh, change. And she looks at him and says, I know. I knew you were a pastor, and I wanted to see how you would react. Wow, right? Wow. You never know who's watching you. You never know the influence you're having. You never know 